yeah version i can't take people physically now so it's only online now this is where you get to learn how to breathe learn how to organize your mind learn how to align your mind so number two of it is called journaling right so you can have a, a, a pen a paper just start writing how you feel start writing how you feel good people there's power in journaling it shows you how you grow as a person if you were to start journaling now give yourself three months to say listen i am going to record how i feel every day for for three months or it can be seven days it can be a month but normally i prefer for 30 days six months after that go back and read that journal see if you still notice those patterns that you were writing about or complaining about and then you can see that there is some form of growth right and three talking um just talk get a friend who you trust who you feel they won't judge you who you feel um whatever it is that you share with them will not be a topic get a buddy you know sometimes it helps to just dial a random number on your phone and just vent this area will be clear you'll be okay you'll feel lighter right and the holy grail of it all is change your environment tip number three is change your environment i remember when i had time that's like two years ago i used to host weekly sessions there were you know you know like people would come in through the link on zoom and i would give them training 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 and most of the people were suffering from the environment they are in good people there is power in where you live under the roof that you live with who and how do they influence you positively and how do they influence you negatively the environment that you live in has ways of either destroying your mind destroying how you see things destroying how you do things and how you respond to things your environment has the power to feed positivity in your mind and in your everyday life how you do things how you think and how you live so it is important to change your environment number one we look at things like the relationship that you have with the people that you live is it a healthy relationship with your parents your kids or even your your husband and if the answer is no then that's something that we can talk about right and we look at the friends that are surrounding you your surroundings are they having a positive um impact in your life or are you being criticized a lot that also does have a an influence in your mental health right mental health is not about um being sworn at every day it's about what you consume i'll do a live or a video based on that it's about what you consume so the whole idea is for you to train your mind and if you feel i've had my fingers too in deep and i feel like i've been trying 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 and nothing is coming out of it if you have the means if you have the means please relocate or leave the area you have grown up in leave 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 and try this thing called life you cannot know what the world has to offer you if you don't leave where you are if you have means of relocating if you have relatives whom you can go live with for six months a year come back a changed person i'll suggest you do it and good people i'm about to leave now i have said what i needed to say unfortunately um half of my live was mute <sighs> so some of the important stuff that i shared earlier they fell on deaf ears but thank you to joanne for highlighting that she can't hear me otherwise if you're watching live please hashtag live and if you're watching repeat please hashtag the repeat otherwise mwah, see you on the flip side take care bye